Saturday morning. We're heading out with uh, Captain Bob Klaus, Claus, and we're going to try to get some whitefish today. Ice hole adventure number four. Fish on the bottom. Got two in a box. Three. Three in a box? Yep. My dad's already caught three. And you guys gonna start getting three. a little help here. Well now you're using a camera, it might be tougher. <laughs> he, he, he caught three without a camera. And now now he's using the underwater camera. Let's see how he does. Okay, just put up a nice one. Turn on the light so you can see it. Nice big fatty on the jig and rapala. My dad, he's got like five, right? Four. Four? Four, you got two. I got two. And Mark's got zip. Mark's been missing them back there. Got a few on. He got them on, but he can't get them in. He can't finish the deal. I've uh, got a nice visual on the locator. So, yeah. Definitely this deeper water stuff is working better than my shell. Oop. Don't want to lose them. Okay, anyway, the boy, this guy, uh, Bob set us up pretty nice. He drilled all these holes. He's got towels out here for us. All right, brother Mark, hey, finally. One. Hey. Nice one. Put one in the box. We got a box. We got a box. Oh, uh, show them, Mark. Hold them out like John Gillespie. Ooh, yeah, yeah. That's a nice one. Yeah. What the hell? Okay, we're gonna gill them and put them in the in the in the butt in the live well. For for us, it's the dead well. I'll show you. Bob really set us up today, boy. He uh. Put in live wells for us, whatever, where we can keep our fish from freezing. Hey, Brother Mark. Hey, I finally got this white fish and figured out. What's that? You getting dialed in over there? Finally figured it out, you know. These Wisconsin fish are a little different. But, yeah? You know, they're, they're nice, nice fish. I'm starting to put a few in the box, finally getting them up the hole. Good job, so, brother. Uh, like I say, I'm getting it dialed in. I was calling them No Fish Mark for a while. It runs in the family. Well, like I say, I got it dialed in now, so look out. All right, Mark's he's catching up. From here on. I better start getting serious. Okay, my dad's got one coming up the hole. We're gonna look down as he brings it in. You can't see where he is. He's off to the side somewhere. Oh, there he is. Cool, nice one. Awesome. Okay. I forgot my scoop, my tongs at home. Ready, Pop? Yep. Cool. All right. In the, in the, in the, in the shack. <laughs> Good job. What is that? That's like six for you or something. Five. Five? Good That's job, five. Pop. Yeah. yeah, so we're catching up. Yep. Stay in the lead, I should have said. Okay, got one going. I think I got him on camera, biting. See if we can see him coming down in the hole. Boy, these guys fight hard. 
Oh, there he is. In the hole. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Okay, I just I just set Leroy up with the jig and wrap because that's what Mark and I are been doing pretty well with. Uh, I'll get some recording going and hopefully we'll hopefully we'll see something. Okay, there he is. He's coming down right now. If we get some in here, I'll record it and hopefully see him catch one. Okay, brother Mark just pulled up the sixth fish. Yeah, now he's talking like talking smack <laughs> when he, he he was struggling so hard this morning. I was calling him no fish, Mark. Good job, brother. My dad, he's been slacking. Yeah, Mark all of a sudden took over. I had five. I was on the leaderboard for a while, but he just snuck by me. Yep. To get serious here. Mark's got six. Dad's got five. I've been helping these guys along, so. <laughs> excuses, excuses. <laughs> I'm like two for five myself, but oh well, I'll catch up. Okay. Yeah, nice one. Look at that. I forgot my grabbers in my truck, so I gotta do it with my hand. Hey, Leroy's got one going. Bending that little rod right in half. Good job, Pops. Ooh, Ooh scrapper. He's a scrapper, and he's gone. No, nope. yeah, he pulled off. What? Yeah, he cut my camera wire. What? Oh, man. Uh, Choke. Hey. You didn't catch your camera wire, how could you? No. Yeah, yeah, you got in the camera. Oh, okay. Okay, definitely got a nice day today. Uh, Captain Bob has a pretty nice setup with these, uh, with these Clam 5600s. Man, we couldn't ask for a better spot. Lots of fish and uh, pretty quiet, which is good. Away from the group, we're very pleased. You know, we uh, brought our own gear, everything, and just uh, hired Bob to, to set us up as far as on a spot with Shack. And he drilled all our holes, has all kinds of, um, had everything set up for us real nice. So, very pleased. Okay. Leroy and Mark are working together. Oh! 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 oh. oh where's the thorn? Look at that, I'm stuck in the finger, but I still made a... Dive for <laughs> what happened? I didn't have the tongs, I couldn't use this hand because I'm stuck. Uh, <laughs> Dad snagged me now. Well, like when it popped out of his mouth. Yeah. All right, yeah. good job. They well, still try. We're having fun though. Oh, yeah, <laughs> okay, Pop. What happened? I finally got a nice one. All right, it's on the ice. Oh, yeah. Sweet, good job. Okay, we uh, tore it up. Definitely uh, had a good day. Can't say enough about uh, you know these Green Bay whitefish. Once you get on them, they're fun. A lot of fun. I uh, can't say enough about our guys. We did good. We had some, uh, yeah, it was great. They put us right on some fish. Came and got us. Checked on us. We're good. Took good care of us. Yes, yes he did. Good. So, yeah, uh, best best outing I've had in a long time. We so. caught one short, but it wasn't fish fall. I mean, probably the 30 that we lost. Yeah, we lost more than we caught, but <laughs> but that's all right. They were there. They were there. We did great. Yep. It was a good time had by all. 
All right, let's give her help. Yeah. Now we got fish to clean. A lot of cleaning to do. Okay, yeah. it's Sunday, February 2nd. I'm out on the ice again. Um, it's uh, 12.50. Already, I put one fish on the ice. Um, brother and dad, they headed back home. I'm all by myself. I'm in the shallow waters again, trying it again. I know I struggled with shallow waters all year um, so far, so but I, I feel pretty confident and I'm, I'm using a, uh, my small jig and wrap, pound and bottom. I already caught one and missed one. Bad thing about jig and wrap, those hooks on the ends, they catch the bottom of the ice hole and you lose them. Like yesterday, we lost so many fish at the bottom of the ice hole. Um, it's, it's frustrating, but those jig and wraps, man, they still work so good that I'm still using it. Okay. I just put... Uh, I just put another one on the ice. Um, so I got two right now, and I lost one right at the bottom of the hole. So my game plan's working. Um, the plan is just to get a couple so I can get on the road here. Uh, boy, if I can get a couple more real quick and then get on the road, make it home for the Super Bowl, I'll be doing good. There's one down there. It's tough to see under my camera, so I'm just going to show you the, my rod tip. Got him! Alright! <laughs> the camera view was kind of crappy, so I was trying to show you the rod tip. I think it turned out. Okay, now the next step is trying to get them in this hole without losing them because of that jigging wrap. Alright, got him in the hole. Okay, now I gotta scoop him out later. Man, I missed him. Hook came out and he shot down the hole. Son of a gun. That one went bye bye. Okay, he's got a real nice big one. He nailed my little, that little jigging wrap. Got him through the hole. So, number three's on the ice. Cool, I'm doing good, even in shallow water. Can't believe it. But got my confidence back. Awesome. Okay, I've been jacking them one after another here. Got a pretty good pile of them going out there, um, which is awesome. Uh, I'm going to be heading home with a nice pile of fish, and my confidence is back in shallow water. Sweet. Okay, that's the little jigging wrap that did all the damage. Uh, there's, it's missing the, the little plastic on the tail uh, that fell off earlier because of all the all the fish tearing it up and like I said this thing the bad thing about a jig and wrap it uh, it catches on a damn ice hole lost two fish because of that today lost a bunch yesterday because of that but oh well I'm done gotta get flying um, definitely did really well I'm sure if I stayed I'd get my limit but I don't need that much fish because I don't freeze them. I just eat them fresh. So that's it. I'm gonna wrap her up. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. We got six nice fish. A couple biggies. Look at that guy flapping there. He's a real big one. Let's see. One, two, three big ones. Two mediums and a small so pretty damn good day nobody even around me this is awesome